she got a little bit snippy with the nurses, and I think it was just, like usual, a stunt for publicity. Amber Heard was diagnosed with borderline personality and histrionic personality disorders by Dr. Shannon Curry during her defamation trial with ex-husband Johnny Depp. An old video emerged where Amber was seen snatching a sick baby from a nurse in a child clinic. Considering her mental disorders, it appears that she was mentally sick that time and was trying to prove something. Did the way she handled the baby depict her illness? What was she trying to prove? Keep watching to know more. A video is there of Amber Heard where she was seen snatching a sick baby from a nurse and telling the nurse to let go of her and she will handle the baby. It felt like she was acting like she could handle the baby the best. It appears the video came when she donated 250,000 US to charity and she was just showing off with her donation. The video came into focus when long ago Amber put up an Instagram story with the video when she was in Mexico at a child clinic. She later handed the baby over to her parents and was reacting as if she was so happy and she loved the child. But that was all for a video shoot, as in the video it was clear a cameraman was surrounding her and clicking pictures too. Fans were disappointed with Amber's behavior and the way she snatched the baby from the nurse. Some of them believe it is all because of her mental health issues. They were furious over her and one fan stated, what the hell happened? I just watched the video and it was even worse than I expected. Those nurses were attempting to reclaim the baby or at the very least adjust something and Amber literally turns away while holding the baby and angrily motions for them to leave while saying something. You don't use a sick baby as a prop, you wuss. Another added that she went to a children's hospital and chose a baby to pose with for a photo op. According to one comment, the baby had just gotten out of surgery. The nurses tried to stop her, but she told them to leave. One more comment reads that, this is the most heartbreaking of the clips. She requires serious psychiatric assistance, which she will never receive. Simply wind her up until she explodes. There will be no happy ending for her. She requires either ECT or ayahuasca. Another further wrote, billions of people support Johnny Depp, who doesn't give a damn what this person does or says. Karma is something that a public relations team cannot control. One more fan said, her Spanish is terrible and she sounds ridiculous. Trying to get the nurse to go over there so she can keep taking pictures with a prop sick baby. What kind of sick F does such things for attention? Nobody can say she gives a damn because her phony pledge proved it. One fan added that this occurred in Mexico in 2018. She was at a clinic run by the Smile Train charity. It provides cleft palate surgery to children. This video has a longer version that shows the parents' reactions. Amber appears to be pretending to be a saint. Feel sorry for everyone involved. The nurses and parents must have been terrified that this woman would take the baby at random. Imagine waking up from anesthesia to find yourself being held by a stranger. All fans believe that this was due to her illness. Dr. Shannon Curry proved that Amber Heard is mentally ill. She was having borderline personality disorder as well as histronic personality disorder. According to Heard's psychologist, the only condition she has is post-traumatic stress disorder as a result of Depp's alleged abuse. But a psychologist by Depp proved her wrong. While histronic personality disorder is a recognized diagnosis in the American Psychiatric Association's Diagnostic and Statistical Manual, some mental health professionals believe it is outdated, sexist, and stigmatizing. Histronic personality disorder, like BPD, is related to narcissistic and antisocial personality disorders, which are often characterized by dramatic, excitable, or volatile behaviors. According to recently updated continuing education materials for psychiatrics and psychologists, Histrionic personality disorder specifically describes exaggerated emotions and attention-seeking behaviors. Patients must meet at least five of the following criteria to be diagnosed with the condition. It includes, when not the center of attention, the person feels uneasy, provocative or seductive behavior, emotions that shift and are shallow, draws attention through appearance, speech that is impressionistic and hazy, 
exaggerated or dramatic emotions, suggestible, and considers relationships to be more intimate than they actually are. These characteristics must also be present and affect the person's daily functioning. The typical patient is flamboyantly dressed, engaging, and entertaining at times. Their stories are usually very interesting and told with a lot of emotion. Meanwhile, borderline personality disorder is a type of mental disorder that affects how a person thinks and feels about themselves. People with this have identity diffusion, which means they don't know who they are and it can be so severe that they attempt to join a cult or adopt a persona to give them some sense that they are real and have an identity. They have a very strong fear of abandonment and they have extreme mood swings, so they can be triggered to anger or sadness at any time. Do you think Amber snatching the kid and behaving like an abnormal is due to her disorders? Let us know in the comments below. Make sure to subscribe for more.